All right, good, uh, good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to the Committee on Land Use. I am Councilmember Rafael Salamanca, Chair of this committee. I would like to welcome my esteemed colleagues who are members of the committee and are present today. We have Council Members Gibson, Barron, Kuhl, Lansman, Levin, Miller, Reynoso, Richards, Traeger, Chair Adams, Chair Moya, and Rivera. I want to thank Chair Moya and Chair Adams for their work on our land use subcommittees. Today we will be voting on projects referred out of both of our subcommittees. We will vote to approve the OUs 469, the 38-01 23rd Avenue rezoning for property in Councilmember Constantinides District in Queens. The proposal would establish a C2-3 commercial overlay district within an existing R5B district to allow the applicant to seek a special permit for a physical culture establishment from the border of standards and appeals. This will legalize an existing gym and yoga studio as well as allow future uses consistent with the proposed C2 district regulations. The original proposal was modified by the City Planning Commission to remove from the rezoning area that portion of the proposed C2-3 overlay beyond 100 feet north of 23rd Avenue within 75 feet of Steinway Street. We will also vote to approve LUs 470, the 76 Drive and Austin Street rezoning for property in Councilmember Kozowitz District in Queens. The proposal would rezone an existing R2 zone district in the neighborhood of Forest Hills as a R3-2 district and would facilitate the legalization and expansion of use group four medical offices within existing buildings in the rezoning area. We will vote to approve with modifications LU number 466, the 515 West 18th Street Garage Special Permit application for property in Speaker Johnson's district in Manhattan. The original application was for a special permit to allow 180 space attended accessory parking garage. The new building would include approximately 181 dwelling units and could have approximately 41 accessory parking spaces as of right. The application was modified by the City Planning Commission to reduce the total number of parking spaces from 180 to 110. Our modification will be to further reduce the maximum number of permitted per, uh, spaces to the more appropriate numbers of 100. The applicants relied upon certain assumptions in establishing the project demand for the parking facility. All available data for the surrounding census tracts, such as household size, may not have been factored in. For example, the vehicle ownership rate for the proposed development may be lower than was projected by the applicants. Based upon this balanced approach, the 100 spaces are expected to be sufficient. We will vote to approve the OUs 467 and 468, the uh, 784 Cortland Avenue applications submitted by the Department of Housing Pres and Preservation for property in my district in the Bronx. LUs 467 is an applicant for the fourth amendment to the Melrose Commons Urban Renewal Plan. The amendment would remove a 45 foot height restriction app applicable to site 15 of the plan. LUs 468 is for approval of the Urban Development Action Area designation for the property located at 359 East 157th Street and 784 Cortland Avenue and the approval of an Urban Development Action Area project for such area and pursuant to 197C of the New York City Charter for the disposition of such property to a developer selected by HPD. These applications will facilitate the construction of a seven-story mixed-use building with approximately 20 residential units, all of which will be affordable and will include ground floor retail space, community facility, and a 15% homeless set-aside. LUs 446 and 465 have been withdrawn and will be filed. Are there any questions or remarks from members of the committee? No? All right, seeing none, I will now call for a vote in accordance with the recommendations of the local council members and the subcommittees to approve LUs 467, 468, 469, and 470, and to approve the modifications I have described, LUs 466, 466, and to file LUs 464 and 465. Council, please call the roll. Lee Martin, committee clerk, roll call vote committee on land use. All items are a couple. Chair Salamanca. Aye, no. Gibson. I vote aye. Barron. I vote aye. Who? Aye. Lanceman. Aye. Levin. Aye. Miller. Aye. Reynoso. Aye. Richards. Aye. Traeger. Aye. Adams. Aye. Moya. Aye. Rivera. By vote of 13 in the affirmative, zero in the negative, and no abstentions. All items have been adopted on today's agenda. Thank you. I would like to thank members of the public, my colleagues and council and land use staff for attending today's hearing. 
Uh, the role will stay open for 10 minutes.